Bennett Street Dairy Red Velvet and White Chocolate Cookie Dough from the refrigerated section. Have you ever had pre-made cookie dough before? Too expensive, right? How much is it? $13 full price. That's crazy. This one was a Christmas special edition red velvet flavour. Usually it's either chocolate chip cookie or white chocolate and macadamia cookie. I wanted to try it but not pay $13, so I paid $6.50 for this on clearance after Christmas. And red velvet's an interesting thing that you don't get very much of. So we're going to see if it's good quality or not. This is from Bondi in New South Wales. We made eight regular cookies. I didn't shape them. I just used a knife and I just cut it into eight pieces and that's why they look so ugly. So they're meant to go in the oven for 15 minutes at 180. We left them in there for a little bit longer just to make sure. 17 minutes. It smells very sweet. It smells like cookie. Do you know what red velvet is? Not really. Want to explain it? It's uh, red, <laughs> red food colouring. You don't know. I don't know. I don't eat this sort of thing. Ooh, it's got condensed milk in it. It'll be so sweet. And white chocolate compound. Do you like eating raw cookie dough? No. Me neither. Do you know, I don't think I've ever in my whole life bought a stick of cookie dough in the, from the refrigerated section, pre-made, and then made cookies out of it. So this is the first for me. I usually like to make my own cookie dough. This is way too expensive. Anyway, if you want to see what it looked like when we opened it, it looked like this. It kind of looked like Play-Doh, really. Yeah, the, the stick when we opened it up was ugly and unexpected looking. It did look like Play-Doh. It's hard to tell when it's ready too, because it's already like... Yeah, the colour's a, a bit off. Colour. Anyway, why don't you try some? See if it's any good. They were baked about 10 minutes ago. They're still soft in the middle. That looks very moist. That looks good. Now, you were talking about Subway cookies being a bit uh, chewy and moist, right? Yes, I like soft, chewy, moist cookies. Well, this is warm, soft, chewy from, from the look of it. And a bit crunchy. That's nice. Good start. Mm -hmm. And you got milk too. You'll be a happy girl. I definitely need milk. Came prepared today. Oh, that's really nice. It's worth six bucks. One cookie would be like 80 cents. Not bad for 80 that's, cents. That's pretty good for 80 cents. That is nice. Surprisingly nice. Oh. I don't think it'll fall apart in the milk. I wouldn't leave it in the milk too long. It'll oh, make your look. yeah. It's it'll going, make your milk purple. It's going colourful. That is nice and milk. It soaks it up good. Then you can suck it back out. No, it's actually not as sweet as I thought it would be. I thought it would be more sugary. Are you getting any cupcake vibes out of that? Because red velvet, the only time I've really seen it. Or had it is in cupcakes. It is a bit cakey in the middle. It's like a moist cupcake Ooh. in the middle. But the crunchiness on the outside is nice. I couldn't eat this every day though, it's very rich. I kind of wanted to hate these cookies. Uh, I know you did. But they're I really so expensive. Like them. I like the edges, they're crunchy and sticky. What do you reckon? I reckon this would be higher quality than a Subway cookie. It's very nice. I give it an 11. And it's an 11? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, that's, that's the highest rating, like the equal highest rating on the channel. Mm -hmm. Nothing is higher than an 11 and hers is gone. I've still got the middle of mine. Wow. It's very nice. And uh, like I said, I really wanted to hate it, but I couldn't. I'm going to give it a nine, maybe because I don't have milk. Well, because you had to make it. <laughs> if I had no, to make right. it, I might not give it an 11. Okay, see ya.